Hey, thank you for joining the Beyond Photography show again. And like usual, you're going to learn amazing tutorial. And today's tutorial is how to shoot reflective products. And I thought the best reflective product to shoot would be shooting a hard disk. You see, over the years, I've accumulated a lot of hard disks because we own a lot of computers in the lab and all that. So many times, this hard disk just die on me. I always save the hard disks itself because they are so reflective and I like to use them to teach product photography and commercial reflective photography because if you do this wrongly, you're going to see the reflection of the cameraman's face there. John, say hi to John. And the best way to shoot reflective product is not to light up the product itself, but to use something we call a flag. Now, the best way to deal with flag is not to ask your mother-in-law to hold a flag for you. What I like to use is a flag holder. This is actually an arm that can swing like this. So there you go. I'm going to be lighting up this. I'm, I'm going to be shooting this hard disk. I choose this particular one because it's clean. Always keep it closed up like this so that you don't get dust. So I'm going to put the hard disk here and shoot from there. So I reckon that I'm going to get reflection from here. So this is what I'm going to do. Take a big flag like this. And then mount one here. There's actually a bracket that you can hold this down. Right, move this to the side and mount this here. I guess you still need your mother-in-law to do this. There you go. So I'm going to place this flag here now so that it reflects back a white surface for the hard disk. And then I'm going to take this flash now and boom, hit the light somewhere here. Two feet away on a bare flash is always F16. If you add on a flag like this, you're going to shave off two stops. So two stops from F16 is going to be F8. Presenting your lighter's cheat sheet. So I've got it all now. My ISO is 200. My shutter speed is 200. I'm shooting at a white balance of 5260. And I'm going to make my camera go on vivid mode. So that way I'm going to get a punchier color. Pop up your flash, make sure this is manual. And I also like to slap on close-up filter. This is a times four. Now I like to do this on still life because it allows me to shoot closer. Boom. Beautiful. One shot. That's how you shoot reflective product. Always light up the reflected item. <laughs> there you go. That's how you shoot difficult reflective product like a hard disk and still get away with this. Remember the rule, light up what is reflected and do not light up that product itself. I'll see you again for the next Beyond Photography show. Continue watching our show and shoot nice pictures. If you're two feet away on a bare flash, it's always F16 at a power 1 over 8. But now we put a flag, which is going to cut away two stops. So what you're going to get is that you're going to get F11, and then you're going to get uh, F... What am I talking? F8. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> don't cut, don't cut, don't cut. <laughs>